Hello, everyone, and welcome to Sports Court Special Edition of Trade Talk. This is going to be Episode 9. I'm Nicholas Scalaro. And I'm Charles Green Bay. Today, we'll be going over NBA Trade Talk and Free Agents and the MLB Trade Talk and Free Agents. Roll that intro. Now, to start off, we're going to talk about the NBA free agents and trade talk. In recent news, the Rockets trade Russell Westbrook to the Wizards for John Wall. The Celtics also trade Gordon Hayward to the Hornets. The Los Angeles Lakers trade McGee to the Cavs for Jordan Bell and Alfonso McKinney. The Lakers also trade Danny Green in the 20th overall pick in the 2020 NBA Draft for Dennis Broder. Now, for free agents, Anthony Davis re-signs with the Lakers on a five-year $190 million deal. LiAngelo Ball reportedly signed one year non guaranteed contract with the Pistons. LaMelo Ball has signed his rookie contract with the Hornets. LeBron James re signs with the Lakers on the two year, $85 million max contract extension. Nick, what do you think about these free agents? I think the free agents got what they needed. I mean, Anthony Davis expected that money because he is one of the top players. I expected to see one of those contracts come for him. No matter what it was, it was going to be a high contract no matter what. The Lakers are going to be nasty good still with LeBron James and that combo of Anthony Davis. It, the Lakers aren't going anywhere in the next four to five years, I say. Now moving on to LaMelo Ball, I think it's going to be very interesting to see how he plays in NBA style of games because he came from a high school type college play style. So it's going to be very interesting. And then with it, Leangelo, I feel like he's going to be washed up because he hasn't played basketball in over three years. And he's now signing a one-year deal with the Pistons. I just don't see him making any good moves to where he can continue his NBA career. Next, let's move on with the MLB free agent signings and trade talk. First on our boards, we have Charlie Morton signs with the Braves for a one-year, $15 million contract. Next up, we have Mike Miner, signs with the Kansas City Royals as a two-year, $18 million contract. Next up, we have Trevor May, signs with the New York Mets. He signed for a two-year, $15 million contract, terms not disclosed. Last, we have Michael A. Taylor, signing with the Kansas City Royals. He signed for a one-year deal, one-year deal, $1.75 million. As of now, these free agents are making huge moves for these teams. As of now, Charles, what do you say about these free agents being signed? I feel like all these free agents you talked about have all performed very well. There's not one player that we have seen on there that hasn't been one of the top tier players that we've had our eyes on. So I feel as if later on in these next couple games, we all, we're going to see them play to their top tier. Now that was your special edition of Trade Talk for Sports Group. Make sure you guys tune in to our YouTube, HMG News. I'm Charles Green Bay. And I'm Nicholas Galaro. Make sure you tune in to us every Monday to watch our daily videos of Sports Court. Also, don't forget to hit that follow button at our Instagram at PacMediaGroup. to see our daily sports posts that we put up. Thank you guys and see you guys later.